When you're buying router bits for the shop, here's what I want you to do. Whenever possible, get yourself a half inch shank router bit instead of a quarter inch shank. Right here on the table, I've got two bits, identical profiles. They're both quarter inch round over, one half inch shank, one quarter inch shank. Now the deal is, a couple of benefits here. One is that, of course, because the shank on a half inch shank bit is bigger, it's less likely to flutter under cutting pressure, which means you're gonna get a better cut as a result of what you're doing with your router. The other thing is that because the diameter is bigger, the circumference is also greater, that gives your collet a much better bite on this router bit. As a result, it's much less likely to come loose. For the most part, what you'll find is that the half inch shank bit doesn't cost any more or it's only a tiny bit more than the quarter inch shank, but you get a lot of benefits out of using it. The reason that you might choose to stick to a quarter inch shank bit would be if you're using something like a laminate trim router where you're limited to quarter inch shank cutters. But most mid-size and larger routers come with both a quarter inch and a half inch collet. They're capable of taking either one. And my advice to you is whenever you can, get the half inch shank bit for your machine.